वेरी वेरी वॉम वेलकम टू रिहंत ऑनलाइन अकेडमी इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट मिनी मॉक टेस्ट फॉर यू जी सी नेट एंड जे आर एफ कंप्यूटर साइंस क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज द आई पी एड्रेस विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग आई पी एड्रेस इज यूज बाय होस्ट वेन दे आर बींग बूटेड सो फोर आई पी एड्रेसेज आर गिवन जीरो डॉट जीरो डॉट जीरो डॉट जीरो और वन डॉट जीरो डॉट जीरो डॉट जीरो और वन डॉट वन डॉट वन डॉट वन और टू फिफ्टी फाइव डॉट टू फिफ्टी फाइव डॉट टू फिफ्टी फाइव डॉट टू फिफ्टी फाइव सो द डी ऑप्शन बेसिकली इट इज यूज फॉर लिमिटेड ब्रॉडकास्टेड एड्रेस वेन वी वॉन्ट टू सेंड द ऑल कंप्यूटर्स इन अ इन अ पर्टिकुलर नेटवर्क इफ यू वॉन्ट टू सेंड मैसेजेस टू ऑल कंप्यूटर्स विथ अ सिंगल कंप्यूटर देन वी यूज दिस एड्रेस and when system is being booted then the correct answer 0.0.0.0 is the ip address which is used when a system is being booted so option a is the correct answer the next question is consider a relation r a b c d e f g h okay so a relation is there in which uh, uh, several elements existed like a b c d e f g h where each attribute is atomic every attribute is atomic and uh, following functional dependencies are there which existed the relation r is so it is related to normal forms okay guys and we need to uh, find the answer that uh, this relation is uh, related to which normal form so uh, if you will see the relation if i derive the closure of a plus then a plus can derive a itself it can derive b it can derive c i derive this from this relation further b can derive c f and h so c is already here f and h further a, f is deriving e and g so i can add e and g as well and uh, e can derive a a is already here and c h can derive g g is already there but if you will observe here d is missing d is missing here so if d is missing Uh, so i need to conclude that uh, for b closure as well b closure also can derive c f h f can derive e n g so e n g i can add so ultimately d is missing d can d cannot be derived d cannot be derived from any element isn't it because d is d doesn't exist in the relation so partial dependency would be there why partial dependency would be there partial dependency would be there every time why because d is missing so if d is missing i need to add d with every key why because to make presence of d as well in the relation so partial dependencies existed that is why this relation is only in 1nf it is not 2nf why it is in 2nf because the definition of two second normal form is when there is a partial dependency when any non functional key is dependent on partial uh, on uh, a primary key then it is only you can say that uh, it is in 2n but partial dependency is here and due to partial dependency this relation is only in 1n so option a is the right answer question number 3 which of the following pairs have different expressive powers okay single tap turing machine and multi dimensional turing machine so in the definition of turing machine we have discussed whatever type of turing machine you have all turing machine all turing machine have same same expressive power same expressive power so it is true it it is true uh, single uh, it is false Sing, uh, single tape turing machine and multi dimensional turing machine so they have exp same expressive power what we need to answer which have different expressive power so option a is having same expressive power multi tape turing machine and multi dimensional turing machine again turing machine is there so it is again you can say that it is they all have, all are having uh, same expressive power and option c deterministic push down automata and non deterministic push down automata so dpda is there and npda is there so they don't have same expressive power they don't have same expressive power so option c is the answer because in our question it is asked that which of the following pairs have different expressive power so option c is the answer which is having different expressive power okay and the deterministic finite automata that is dfa and nfa dfa and nfa they both have same expressive power that is why we can convert each in every nfa to dfa 
but we cannot convert every NDPDA to DPDA because they have different expressive power. So option C is the correct answer for this question. So I just added very, very detailed analysis to you with four, all four options. So you can get the correct uh, analysis of the question, get the pattern, that get the level of the question, get the concept as well, right? So guys, if you are facing any kind of doubts, queries, do comment us. I will try to solve them as early as possible from my side. Question number four. A member function can always access the data in the class of which is which it is member. So option A itself is correct. If we go with the C++ programming language, then a member function is there. So member function can always access the data in the class of which it is a member. So option A is the correct answer, guys. Question number five. Which of the following is not correct for virtual function in C++? So for virtual function, let scan all the options one by one. Option A must be declared in public section of class. It is true. Virtual function should be declared in public section of class. Option B virtual function can be static. It is false because virtual function cannot be static, can't be static. Option C virtual function should be accessed using pointer again true. And option D, virtual function is defined in base classes. It is again true. So option B is the only answer which is uh, which is uh, incorrect. That is why uh, it is the correct option for our question, right? Guys, do subscribe our YouTube channel. Press the bell icon button so that in our uh, upcoming time also, whenever we will try to for form our very very important lectures like this and. Uh, more on important lectures for the all CSIT exams. So do comment, do ask your queries, subscribe, press the bell icon button so that you can get aware of these questions and this concepts and right and you can score better in your upcoming exams. Question number six in SQL structured query language, which of the following is aggregate function? So you all know that in SQL very easy question five aggregate functions are there which of the five aggregate function is average next one is count then mean max and sum these five are aggregate functions so average is there so option c is the correct answer next question in rdbms that is relational database management system Different classes of relations are created using which technique to prevent a modification anomaly, anomalies. So normal for whenever you see the keyword anomalies, na, itself you can derive that normal forms are in the picture because due to, and with the help of normal forms techniques, we can prevent modification anomalies. Option D is directly you can answer. Next question, which of the following devices takes data sent from one network device and forward to the destination not based on MAC address. So MAC address is nothing but physical address and switch is the device which uses physical address in order to send and forward the data from one device to another networking device. So option C is the correct answer. Question number nine, which of the following layer of OSI model, OSI reference model, okay is also called end to end layer end to end layer means from one end of the system to another end directly uh, sending and getting information and transport layer is, de uh, is the layer which is responsible for this functionality in uh, osi reference model so option d is the correct answer guys and the question number 10 if every non key attribute is functionally dependent if every non key attribute is functionally dependent on the primary key then the relation is in it is the definition of second normal form second normal form itself says that if every non key attribute is functionally dependent on primary key then the relation is in second normal form so it is directly asked the definition of 2nf and it is previous year ugc net questions so i think you can get the concept uh, pattern level of the question that what kind of questions ugc net are asking and you can prepare according to that right so guys i hope all these questions which i have discussed with you are very very clear to you further if you have any kind of doubts or queries in any kind of question just comment us i will try to solve your all queries and problems as early as possible from my side have a very very nice day guys jai hind jai bharat